this part is very optional and uh, it's a little extra to what we've covered before. Uh, this will cover how to measure the volume. Sometimes you uh, get asked by a surgeon, well, what's the volume of the liver? Or how big is the tumor? And you don't want to give like what's the, what are the dimensions of the liver? What are the dimensions of the lesion? You also might uh, be interested in giving the surgeon information about the volume of the liver or uh, say what percentage of the liver is the lesion. So, uh, well, as you might uh, guess, you have to perform the segmentation of the liver to um, measure the volume and we already have segmented liver before. So um, let me just check just the liver. And there is a built-in tool in 3D Slicer to measure segmentation volume. When you go to your modules and go to all modules, you will find a module called Segment Statistics. When you click on it, make sure that your segmentation is selected, that the volume is the one that your segmentation was made on and then you just leave create a new table uh, i.e. table with the results. You click apply and almost instant instantaneously you'll get the results and it will give you information that for this specific segment uh, has this volume. So in our case the liver has approximately 1500 uh, centimeters cubed. Uh, this is basically it. It has a lot of more information such as uh, house field units, median mean. It might also be interested for you and your, if you're working with radiomics, but this is a topic to cover it in the future.